Hey everybody, the Manta here. We're jumping into the Alan Wake again tonight. Uh, so, if you guys need a little catching up, uh, started with me going to the town, went into Bright Falls, was supposed to get a keys from Carl Stuckey, was nowhere to be found, ended up picking up a different set of keys from some creepy lady in a veil and a shawl, uh, got in the car, went to the, went to the cabin by this lake, uh, everything seemed nice. And then Alice thought it would be a good idea to uh, put a typewriter in my room, thinking it would help me to write. I did not take that very well. Alan may be a writer, but he's not passionate about it. Oh. Uh, anyways, she went and disappeared. I jumped into the water to save her, and then I woke up in a car crash. So I shot the flare. I'm just an idiot. I only had one of those. Jeez. Fool. But anyway, that's where we're at. Trying to get to the gas station. And trying to make sure that the Carl Stuckey, the axe-wielding murderer, doesn't finish me off. And lickety split. Alright, manuscript page. Alright, let's take a look. Rose knew she had been gushing, but right now, she didn't care. As far as she was concerned, her brief meeting with Alan Wake was literally the high point of her life. She watched as he got in the car with his wife. She was pretty, confident, at ease with Wake. Not like Rose. They were perfect for each other. She'd have given anything to be called their friend. Oh. Was Rose the lady at the diner that was kind of giving me the eye? I think it was. But this was that was definitely kind of more of a, a hidden manuscript. I don't know if that was part of the the main storyline. But still, the plot thickens. All right. So we're still trying to get to this gas station. Um, because the lights down there. Ah, you stupid, stupid. We're trying to get to the gas station. Hopefully, there's a phone. I can figure out what's going on. Whoa. So that was the lady in the veil, in the in the little flashback. Uh, don't know what that uh, demonic gurgling was, but I'm sure we'll find out soon enough. All right, just traipsing through the woods. I saw the river below. Something uncoiled itself inside my head. What? I realized that I'd have to find a way across. Okay. I didn't even want to look at the water. Yeah, I don't want to look at that lovely Porygon solid yet moving water. Alright. Guess this tree's good as any. Bet it won't break. Bet it won't break. Good. Excellent. Alright. Uh, I think I will cross this. Is this where I'm supposed to go? This isn't going to lead me anywhere. Ah, uh, but you know where it does lead me to? A coffee thermos, some more Coco Moo. Because, you know, Alan Wake, whether he's in a dream or in the real world, he needs his liquids. He needs to stay hydrated. Stay active. Alright. So I'm still trying to figure out... I think this is a dream. You know, there's there's some weird stuff happening in Bright Falls, but it just doesn't make sense if they're, like, real people that have these problems. Okay, alright. Another manuscript page. Let's keep reading this book that doesn't exist yet. Barry Wheeler was bouncing off the walls. He jumped on a plane after his calls were ignored by both Al and Alice for several days. It could mean that they were both on a second honeymoon, but Barry didn't buy it. Al had been way too unstable for that. Not sleeping. Messed up. Barry had years of experience dealing with Alan Wake, and he couldn't ignore it. Something was wrong. Alright, so... It looks like Barry, my... Editor? My editor... Thinks something was up while I was in Bright Falls, and he is traveling here, so is that... Real? Uh, things that he's writing in his dreams coming true? What's going 
Carl. Stucky. Stucky was still out there in the dark, stalking me. <laughs> stalking you like <laughs> he's got some photos of you in his little in his little shack back there and because everybody in Bright Falls is a fan of Alan Wake, the best writer. Alright, is there anything over here? Nope. Yeah, and I, I just want to get into some, like, fighting. So much of this game is just running around in these woods. Whoa! Oh, sh They can throw their axes now? That's bull crap. Woo! Woo! Oh, he's got a sickle. He's got a sickle. Get! I don't... Get out. get dodge cinematic. Come on, stay with. Oh, All right, come on, you little. Shh. Get me out of here. Woo! You know, having this shake weight flashlight is just is not is not doing it for me. Come on, get back in here. Get back in here. Well, bam. Got him. No axe wielding, tossing murder spree is gonna take care. Yeah, I got nothing. There's nothing there. All right, clamp these, clamp the rocks. <laughs> Why don't you give that jump another try? Here you. Ah, oh, he got it that time. Caution. Proceed at your own risk. Logging area ahead. All right. Is that another? Is that more urine arrows? Excellent. So there's these arrows written by, who I'm just for now thinking it's Clarence, pointing me to some hidden treasure around the map, or maybe he's just leading me on a wild goose chase. Maybe these arrows are not going to help me at all. Ooh, maybe. Like I said, love the atmosphere of this game uh, and how much it really does remind me of. Twin Peaks and the like. Ooh, nice. I guess I was supposed to go up this way. Uh, taken. The taken, taken are filled with darkness. Well, that was kind of apparent, uh, you know, with all the shadows oozing out of them like slime. But I appreciated the the, the advice there. All right, what well, we got? Please be another flare. Or some more Energizer batteries. I'll take it. Beggars can't be choosers. I would have chosen flares, but that's my own dumb fault for firing them off in the first place. Okay. I'm just gonna jump. Nice. All right, let's uh, let's keep going. Stucky's still out here somewhere, and I intend to hit him with my light. Not physically, just hit him with the beam. And hopefully the knock him out of the equation. Broken. I had to make my way up some other way. Couldn't you jump it? Yeah, probably not. You're pretty weak. Oh, come on. N okay. N still no flare ammo. That's upsetting. Okay. Can't go up the stairs. How much you wanna bet that I have to find some sort of mechanism? To pull that to connect between those two. There was no power. Oh, I power thought I'd figured out so fast. Somewhere at the logging site. All right. Generator. Generator Rex. Wasn't that a Cartoon Network show for a while? It's kind of like a Ben 10 sort of feel to it. And whoa. Oh. Shoot three of them. God, this is not. I am not. I'm just not good at this game. Whew. Come on. All right. Um. Woo! Burst of speed. Get out of there, bud. Come on, Alan Wake. Shoot. Run. Get. Oh, this isn't good. Got one. All right. Come on. Knock the other guys out. Get! Get! Woo! Get out of that town! 
You are not using those properly. Yeah. Watch yourself. Get wrecked. I am not a piece of lumber. I am a human being. A piece of wood for you to cut. Damn it. Come on. I hate how sporadically they make me use these click action moments to do stuff. Okay. Repair the generator. Well, let's go back. Ooh, can I go inside there quick? Oh, another manuscript page. Let's see if this reveals anything more. I heard them before I saw them, swooping down from the sky and screeching as they came. I spun around just as the cloud was upon me. For an instant, I stared into a hundred dead eyes, black pearls glittering in the darkness. I raised the flashlight and the swarm exploded like fireworks. Feathers burned, turned into ash. I couldn't hear my scream above theirs. Jeez. Is this an Alfred Hitchcock film? <laughs> Sorry. Well, there was the, the birds did attack me uh, when I was trying to get to Alice in the, in the cabin. So I wonder if I'll get to see them again. I hope so, because those things were fun to fight. <laughs> All right. Um, easy. Look at that. Solving puzzles like it's my job. All right, I'll just go up the ladder. Get to that gas station. Get out of this nightmare. I gotta say, I really love uh, puzzle elements to video games. Uh, I just got finished playing Dishonored 2 a little while ago, and they have a logic puzzle in that game uh, that you can find the answer uh, later on in the level, but I literally sat down with a pen and paper, wrote out the answer. It took me like half an hour, but I was so proud of that moment uh, that they actually decided to put that in a video game to challenge people. It was just a really cool move. Oh, Clarence, bathe me in your light. Look at that. I was just outside for a breath of fresh air and what? A shotgun night. ammo. I know most of you are probably in your beds by now, but if you shotgun? Up and around, take a moment. Step outside for a second. Uh, dude, this. No, don't step outside. There are freaking shadow men everywhere. Ooh. Another cash, come on, flare or shotgun. Hee <laughs> Now I'm going to swap over back to my pistol because I'm not an idiot. Alright. Let's get up to that gas station. So it's nice that they have these puzzle elements to it. I mean, they're not terribly challenging, but they're fun to have. Whew, <laughs> boy. Another manuscript. Oh, that's meta. Wake finds pages. At first I kept finding the pages as if by accident. The book I couldn't remember was either a terrible and true prophecy or an act of creation that had rewritten the world. I began to hunt the pages feverishly, for they held the answer to the mystery. With it, I could save myself. With it, I could save Alice. So he's writing about writing about finding pages <sighs> this has more layers than an onion uh, ogres are like onions onions have layers this game by the transitive property the gas uh, station is an ogre now it's light welcoming in the darkness oh got another thermos though jeez Stucky's got a lot of opinions. Okay. Like, he's saying very normal, like, things that normal people would say. Oh. He's. Oh, no. He's coming back, isn't he? I. God, I hate this atmosphere. <sighs> Crap. Where you at? Bitch. Come on. Bitch, run. Woohoo! Cinematic dodge. Get on my level. Burn, baby. 
Yeah, I don't want to deal with you right now. Come on, who's next? Where's your punk friend? Yeah, I see him. I see him hiding there behind that tree. Oh, are you stuck? Are you stuck? I not stuck. Eat my lead. In the a face. Come on, alright, where am I going next? Where's... That's not the right way. I need to go back to the, the gas station. No! Is this just gonna be... Are they just gonna keep coming at me? Alright, let that recharge, recharge. Boom! Oh! Woo! Ha! Good thing you suck at... Suck at axing. Can I ax you a question? Why do you got a bullet in your face? Why do you got a bullet in your face? Couldn't answer it. It doesn't surprise me. Alright, okay. So, is this just a... This is just like a run-through? Am I supposed to get to the gas station? Am I allowed to? Alright, yeah. So, this is, they're going to keep coming in waves until I get... Shh. Oh, I actually got hit by one. I know your friends around here somewhere. Did you just shove me aside? Ah, this isn't good. Woo! This is the... Oh, he... Oh, he axed his friend! How dare you! Dude. Woo! Sideswipe. Like it. I have no more... Okay. Yep. I'm, I have to use it. I gotta use my flare. Woo! Woo! I have no ammo. I am out of the money. Get up that hill. I can't. I literally can't fight him anymore. And, of course, he is... He is so slow. Alright, get to light. Get to light. Come on. Clarence, heal me. Clarence, give you some more bullets. Thank you, Clarence. Thank you, emergency box stockpiler. Reload that. Okay, come on. Shoot. He's still around here. Yeah, Carl, uh, you talk about food a lot. I'm just worried about you, man. You're just a, You're not acting like yourself. You're saying a lot of crazy crap. Is this gonna turn on? Whoop! Ugh, I can't, There's no sneak element to these, so if I can just... Get out of here with your sickle scythe! I'm out. I'm out of. I'm out of town. I, whoa, 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 Jimmy Christmas. Oh, this ain't good. I have nothing to fight. I gotta just. I gotta keep. I got. I'm gonna go through this battery so fast. Pop! Come on. Thank you. Thank you. Alright, gosh, this combat is tough. Wake lies to the sheriff. The cabin on Cauldron Lake? She asked. The sheriff looked at me suspiciously. The early morning light flooded through the office windows. I would probably never have gotten out of the woods alive without her help. But I couldn't tell her the truth of what I'd faced the previous night. She'd think I was lying or crazy. She'd lock me up. And she wouldn't help me find Alice. Interesting. So all of these are still like it's a story within a story, but they're all telling the same story. You got it? Yeah, neither do I. Okay, okay. Ooh, come on, give me some more batteries. Can I have some more? The game has changed. I have a feeling that this shotgun is going to uh, be remarkably better. Is this Bill Nye the science guy? Bill, 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 Bill. Science rules. Is this the Twilight Zone?
Now, this is interesting. I, I don't have time to watch. I, I don't have time to watch all that. That's fascinating, though. It's like they're they know that they're they're mocking like these old shows, and they're just blatantly sh telling you like, "Yep, that's what I'm doing." Right, let's just do. Yeah, we don't need the woodcutter to have any more than he does. Oh crap! This looks like a boss battle if I've ever seen one. Hmm. Suspicious amount of uh, revolver ammo. Suspicious amount of batteries. Suspicious pieces of log hanging from the hanging from wires. You gonna fight me, Carl? Carly coming at me? Oh, shoot. Come on. Burn him. Come on. Alright. So, it helps when you have so many... When you have so many, uh... So many flashlights that you can just keep swapping out batteries in the middle of the fight. Come on, Carl. Carl. Don't... Don't fuck with me, Carl. Come on! Get out of there! Run! Woo! I am getting wrecked. Riggity, riggity. Riggity, riggity, wrecked. Come on! Shh! Oh. Piece of... I'm gonna use a shotgun. I have a shotgun. I'm sure that would actually help a bit more than just running around like a fool. Just, I'm not even going to try to mess with that pistol right now. Come on. Come on, Carl. Where's your friends at? Alright, I've had enough of you, you piece of... Whoop! I'm... This is going to take forever. Burn! Alright, okay. How close do I have to be? Should... Is this... That was enough. Woo! -hoo! Boom! Nice. All right. So this out. This is a lot better than those freaking pistol rounds. All right. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So he's definitely. He's got some extra. He's got some extra skill that these other goon. These other goons don't even have. Oh shit! I didn't even reload. Come on. Run! Oh shit! Come on, get out of there! Come on, Alan! I know, I know, Alan! I know, Alan! I know it's tough, Alan! I know you're gonna, Alan! You, you're so weak! You are so weak! Why don't you write, write a page, write a manuscript that says, "And then I killed them all with one bullet, like the badass that I was." Okay, come on. I'm gonna do it this time. Third time's a charm. Can't go for it. I can do it. Patience, yep. Yeah. He gets me every freaking time. Come on. I'm gonna... Reload that. Reload that. Okay. Alright, so I got the full battery. Got... I am gonna die again. Okay, so I just have Carl left. Where's he at? Carl? Carl, where you at, buddy? Carl? Carl, you got some dark, shadowy goop around you, Carl. I'm just here to help. Damn it, where you at? 
Stay still. Stay still. You take so you take a lot of shots. No, I'm not gonna miss my shot. No, I'm not gonna waste my shot. Reach the lights the gas station alive. Alexander Hamilton. Oh, goodness gracious. It's more frustrating than scary. It just takes time. You I can't just go into those willy nilly because if you don't time those cinematic dodges right at the perfect time, the parade float I had seen in you're going to get hacked to bits. Ride with Alice. Oh, yeah, Deer, deer Fest. Of course. All right. Let's, uh, let's get into that gas station. Carl's After the insanity I had just experienced in the darkness, the lights of the gas station felt comforting. Yeah. At least for a moment, the same world reasserted itself. Heal me. All right, so we're coming up about this. I'm hoping that this is it. It looked like someone had trashed the place, or that there'd been some kind of fight. Because I don't want to keep you guys any longer, but I also want to get... All right. Ow. I'll keep writing. Outside, there's only darkness. Outside the cabin, outside the story, there's only darkness. I can feel a presence in the dark. Just now, I could smell a perfume in the room. What? I'll reach her. I'll fix it. I'll, I'll bring her back. The story will come true. If I stop, she's lost. What? I don't believe this. It'd been me on the TV, talking crazy. What? Was I losing my mind? Ah, oh, it's so... I, I don't know what's real. Alright, just... Let's hope that police chief calls up again. Rainfall Sheriff Station. Oh, thank goodness. What? So I was on the TV... I was in the room, I was typing, because apparently that's the only way to get my wife back, to get Alice back. Oh God, Sheriff. Sheriff Sarah Breaker, you are... I'm Alan Wake, but listen, I was in a car crash. My wife, Alice, she's missing. Calm down, Mr. Wake. We were staying in a cabin on the island, on Cauldron Lake. There's no okay. island on Cauldron Lake, not since the big eruption in the 70s. What? Please, I can take you there, okay? You look like you've taken a pretty bad knock to the head. Oh, he's down, this is not doing well. Are you okay? Help my bro out. Listen... We'll figure this out. Please get in the car. We'll swing by the lake and then we'll go to the station. Okay? Mr. Wake, have you seen Stucky, the guy who owns this place? Oh. I, I couldn't tell her what had happened. Oh, you've us. seen Stucky. She wouldn't have believed me. Seen a lot of Stucky. I've Alice. seen bits and pieces of Stucky, you know. Spread out. God. There's just more. There's layers upon layers of this. The island's not there, is it? Bird leg, bird leg cabin isn't even real. There's not gonna be anything there. What? So was that beginning part of it? Ah. Oh. Candy colored clown, they call the Sandman. That's crazy. To my room, so this game is broken up into six different episodes, Matt. That must have been the, the first episode. Wow. Everything is alright. That's ah, oh, there's so many questions. Then I drift away. Wow. Alright. Previously on Alan Wake. Yeah, I'll, I'll skip. Yeah. Get out of here. Don't need to see my statistics. Yeah, I'll quit. Oh, wow. So, episode one of the six-episode series, Alan Wake, done. Finished off Stucky. Uh, but the cabin didn't even exist. So, like, is Alice even real? What's what's in my head and what's not? Is this all just a part of his narrative, the new book that he's writing? I don't know. Maybe you guys know. Write a write in the comment section what you what you guys think is going on up in Al Alan Wake's head. <laughs> Otherwise, uh, taking a little break from this uh, over this weekend.
but I'll jump back into making these Let's Play videos on Sunday. So thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Hasta la vista.